joining hands for a better Pacific, the Secretariat of the Pacific Community and the Pacific Islands Development Forum today signed a Memorandum of Understanding that seals a commitment to work together to address issues relating to sustainable development in the Pacific region. Well, the Secretariat uh, of the Pacific Community is a development organization. We work mainly with uh, providing scientific and technical advice to governments, to our members. And uh, so the, the, the PIDF is a, uh, an entity that's supported by governments. Uh, so it's important for us to develop that relationship early to be clear about what we can do to support PIDF and, and conversely how PIDF uh, can support the objectives of SPC. Ultimately, both organizations have to serve the countries. PIDF, as you know, is a, is a, is a new organization. Our capacity and resources are quite limited. Although the uh, idea that uh, gave birth to uh, PIDF is to provide a, a regional platform where multi-stakeholder uh, participations could take place. So at this meeting, uh, we've invited a representative of government, the private sector and civil society. Uh, enabling green, blue economy has been our mandate uh, from the inaugural summit. And uh, we need uh, partners to collaborate with us. Uh, SPC as the biggest uh, uh, provider of regional services has been forthcoming and willing to uh, partner with us. The MOU presents several opportunities for collaboration including the development of joint programs in areas of mutual interest and the commitment to share information. The two organizations have already agreed on a joint activity focusing on youth and green growth. The youth is a, is a major uh, regional issue. Uh, the populations of, uh, of the island countries are uh, made up mainly of youth. Uh, green growth uh, uh, with PIDF uh, is trying to uh, uh, educate them, inform them on the implications of uh, economic and social activities on the environment. But SBC is the great enabler. Whilst we're not in the private sector directly, we engage uh, a lot in the private sector, in the energy sector, in shipping. Uh, we map uh, the ports for countries so that the cruise ships can come in. We, we, we provide training for shipping uh, seamanship uh, safety standards. Uh, so if you like, it's, uh, it's difficult to see how the private sector can engage without all of the work uh, in standards and training, uh, quality assurance and so on, in a range of sectors. The MOU comes into effect immediately. It will be subject to review after two years and renewable by mutual consent at the end of four years. Lauren Robinson, SPC News.